Hello there peeps, welcome back to Subnautica. Today, we are going to take a look at a new blueprint I have discovered. And uh, if we go over to, not that one, this one. And uh, we are going to build the water filtration machine if there is time today. We are also going to expand the base a little bit. And if we go to over here, let me just see if I can find over here the bioreactor. Now, this guy is different from these like the solar panel and the thermal plant. These are renewable energy. Like every time with the thermal plant, when let's say for instance, we have the explodey thing, the, the volcanic thing. Uh, I forgot what it was called, volcanic vent or something. Uh, the thermal plant every time recharges power, all right? And that's what's recharging this power. Every time it blows, it gives us a boost of power. And the solar panel, works with the sunlight, so if the sunlight, uh, well, everybody knows what a solar panel does, but the problem is the solar panels, when that, when the sun goes away, there is no power. And with the thermal plant, it needs to explode every time and be heated up for us, for us to get the uh, power. So the bioreactor is a good way to get power. The one problem with it, though, is it's, it uses uh, plant matter to energy. So it uses plant matter. Last time, I think it was, it said organic material. <clears throat> Excuse me. Yeah, I think it said organic material. I wasn't too sure about that. Well, I'm right now, I'm not too sure about that. But anyways, I uh, just want to eat one more so that we can be ready for the day. So let us continue on. Quickly want to break down some... Ugh. That's just weird when it does that. Alright, breaking this down. I think I only got to grab two of them. Yeah, I did. Alright, Q. Now, okay, that is a bit noisy here. But it's fine. Let's go ahead and... Choose this guy. Recharge it with a 100% battery. Put it away. These guys are all sort of good. And let's go ahead and plop in that guy this one out and get that one out kill so those guys are charging up let's go up here and I want to put away some of these co2 tanks okay give me the creep one cluster because I think it said that we required uh, lubricant I think lubricant is three resources no yeah three we only got two so we have to quickly go out and get one more creep point cluster. We do have sort of space. You know what? Let's let's make some inventory because inventory space because inventory is quite important. Inventory management. Management. Right, there we go. Let's put away some of these batteries. We're not gonna need it now. Laser cutter we can put away. And let's put away one more tank. I'm not too worried about air or anything. I mean we are close to the surface. So yeah, let's get Welcome to the sim off. Captain. Thank you, lady. And let's go over here. To the creep vines. And there should be rendering in. Okay, there is one of those sharky sharks. I don't want to mess with them right now. Let's quickly grab a couple. Get away from me! Make a jump! Ooh, ooh, that's a bit close. Okay, it's not following us. Alright, let's go back to base. Alright, let's just park like this. And our energy is not that great. Maybe we should take a look at the uh, power cell charger as well. Alright, give me one lubricant, please. Thank you. There we go. And put these guys away. Now, what do we require is four titanium. Not that hard. One, two, three, four. There we go. So I was thinking, let's go down, 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 down. Since we have this place, all right, or these guys over here, maybe we should expand one of these ways outwards so that we can hook up the power over there. So let's go outside. Let's grab a couple more titanium. Just in case. Okay, cool. Let's get out here. 
So I want the um, moon pool over this area so that it's easy to park it in and out of. So let's go ahead and get a corridor. Can you, like, place normal? Any... Why does it do that? Hmm. You know what? Let's do the T-junction then. No, why? I just cannot understand why it's doing this. Alright, there we go. Perfect! I like that. Yeah, so we can put the one place over here and this can go to the moon pool. That's perfect! Yeah, that's what I was looking for actually. So it's now a total of 12. Let's quickly go up for air. And a bit more. Come on. There we go. And then a multi-purpose room. Requires six. So let's get that down here. There we go. Uh, uh, uh. Stop laughing at me. I don't laugh at your building. Jeez. Alright, cool, cool, cool. Now let's get back into the base. Along with a large amount of lag. I noticed that every time when we face the east, because that's where the aurora is, then sometimes it lags, sometimes it doesn't. I do get that sometimes. So it's just behind here, this is going to be a problem. I have messed this up. Completely. Yeah, I can deconstruct it. Can we grab fruits? Okay, cool. Now let's go ahead and... Indoor grow bed. Which over here. So we're not going to have food for a while. Let's go ahead and put these guys in here and let them grow. Nice. So this way would be the moon pool, the future moon pool. And this way will be our new power plant. The bioreactor. Alright, cool. There we go. I didn't know you can rotate it though. Sweet. Uh, if you are not already, consider keeping a photo journal of your achievements to remind of you how far you've come. Uh, okay, cool. I guess. What? <laughs> I am quite happy. Thank you. Alright, alright, alright. So, this needs to go. And that also needs to go. But I must say, it looks quite fancy. Really, really fancy. What do you guys think? I think it looks awesome. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Cool. Alright, so... Also, what we need to do is look at the filtration machine. The water filtration. Yeah, where shall you be? Over here. Just two titanium? No problem at all. Let's go up here. Um, let me think, let me think. We do require a couple of pieces of titanium, so let's go, go ahead and look for more titanium. And then we're going to build over here. And see what we can do power-wise and stuff. Maybe we can link them all up. I do not know. There's something we can quickly go grab. A little bit of salvage. How much space do we have? We still have enough. Just want to see if there's anything else. What we also can do to get more titanium. Well, we can just go grab those. <laughs> there we go, and there we go. So the future, I will build the moon pool. I just need to go find the fragments. And this is how I got the bioreactor. And there's something else I also unlocked. I just can't remember what it was. Let's go craft these things down and then we can start building, expanding the base a little bit. Oh crap, I'm so sorry, fish. Didn't mean to drive into you, but you should not be swimming in front of me, should you? Ow! Damn it. Okay, 
Okay, I do have the welder. You should be at number five, bro. Whoops. Let's go ahead. Oops. There we go. I thought I did fix this thing. Eh, oh well. Welcome aboard, Captain. Thank you, weird lady. And now let's go ahead and deconstruct all of these titanium. And we do have some time. What? Well, like I was saying, we still have some time left in the episode to do a bit of building, base expansion, all that. But uh, you just complete it. Nice. We'll take that and that. Thank you very much. Okay, let's go up and let's go ahead and stick these batteries in here. As such. And also, we require lithium to reinforce holes and stuff. But that's a bit later outwards. Ooh, it's a bit dark. Uh, never mind. Now uh, let's go, and the reason why I want it over here is because it's noisy. It's a really noisy thing. Okay, let's go ahead and build you up. And voila! Power restored. All primary systems online. Okay. Now, I am wondering, is this thing getting power and that base not? Our primary base? Yeah, it's gonna get that. Alright, let's get... Oh, crap, we need a... We need glass. Well, that's fine, it's fine. Glass is not a problem. Because we have a couple of quartz back in base. There we go. In this locker, we grab two. Go ahead, that, that, glass. And thank you very much. And now, that thing is a bit useless now, isn't it? Power transmitter. We will see what we have, we must do. But, we do have the, um... The new power plant over there, which is good, I guess. Yeah. Start constructing this so we can get inside the base. Welcome aboard, Captain. All right, and now let's go ahead and get the filtration machine in here. Okay, so there it goes. Why isn't that noisy? Okay, so this is gonna work over time. So maybe a couple of lockers in here would be great because this thing does produce a large amount of salt it does a large amount so I am wondering now can I slap this thing on here no it doesn't look like it Mm. Ooh. Come here, guys. I want you and you. Yeah, I do not know what we're gonna do. We can probably leave that there. I don't think that's gonna be a problem. Since this does have the um, solar panels, what? 550. Didn't we have more or do we have less now? I'm confused. All right. Uh, quickly, survival, survival, we need to get cooked fish, the boomerang, we're gonna be on the fish again, since our trees are not worth it, or not working right now, there we go, alright, that's cool, now I quickly want to see what else do we have, wait a minute, how much power, oh, you still have lots of power, hmm, I did re, I did find that, ooh, Power cell charger. We can probably look at that. Let's go ahead, make a wiring kit, glass, and computer chip. Hmm. Computer chip, I don't think is going to be a problem. Quartz, silver, and two coral samples. Nope. One quartz. One silver. I do have it, right? Yeah. And two coral samples. Uh, uh, uh. Uh, that's mushrooms. One, two. 
cool, cool, cool. There we go, craft that up. And what else? Glass and wiring kit. Now, what does a wiring kit take? A wiring kit is just two silver ore. All right, one, two silver ore. And then let's get some like glass as well. Wiring kit. And then a piece of glass. Nice. And we have everything. Cool, cool, cool. Let's go down and uh, uh, put it. Let's say over here. It looks fine. There we go. Nice. Now, the reason why we need power cells is because. What the hell is that line? It's because our is Seamoth. It does have a power cell back here, which we need to recharge. So let's take it out. And since we have sun now, we can go ahead and plop it in here. Our power is charging up. And let's put it in here. To be honest, I don't remember seeing that before. All these, like when you have a battery, it does... I, I can't remember. Did, did this have it here? This little display? I do not remember, but oh well. So what else? What else? Hmm. Found this lot light. This picture frame. I don't know what kind of picture you want to put on there. And... Yeah, miscellaneous. Alright, let's go ahead and construct a couple of things. Nope. Yeah, how many um, titaniums do we have? One, two, three, four. We have four. And let's grab four lithium. And let's go ahead and put away the gold. Alright. Oh, it requires two titanium. Okay. Let's put you over here. Kill. And one over here. No! Why, why? Why? Okay. And we can probably stick one on the back there as well. One over there, and one probably over there. Can we do this? Okay, no, no, that's, that's fine, that's fine. We can do that. There we go, and last one. So we have actually a pretty decent, strong base. 52. Okay, that's pretty cool. Alright, so yeah, we ran out of time, unfortunately, so I want to say thank you so much for joining me here on Subnautica. Hope you guys did enjoy the episode. If you did, make sure to hit that like button. I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.